In this doodling project, we are going to doodle leaves. We did the flower garden in the last one, and so I just thought it would be fun to do some different leaves around, but we're gonna overlap these and not have as much uh, black in the background. Uh, before I go any further, I just want you to know that I have put little sheets of paper under these other ones in case if you saw me in the last lesson, I came right up to the edge. And so it helps to have a little bit of a blotter paper underneath, unless you have a desk like this. But, you know, I try to, to keep it as clean as possible. That's a joke. Anyway, so let's just play around with some leaf shapes. So I'm just drawing different leaves here and there. Can do some that are more have multiple leaves on them. And we'll do we'll doodle some vines in another lesson where we'll play around with this, but for this one we're just going to do bigger ones. So if you notice, you can't really tell, but this one is kind of overlapping. This big one here is overlapping this small one. And then we can have different types of leaves. Let's pretend that this one is coming out from under. And this one might be an oak or a maple leaf. So you're gonna have to just draw them underneath. And try to figure out where you want them. We'll come back in and add all of our veins. Then you might have some really long leaves. Let's do some going down. Some nice fat leaves. Skinny leaves. Right, let's do a multiple one down here as well to give this a little bit more balance. Then we want maybe a maple looking leaf underneath it. Let's do this one. Let's give it a vein down the center so I can have a little bit of an idea of which direction we want our leaves to come out.
And then I'm just gonna start filling in underneath some of these other leaves. And once you get your page covered with as many leaf shape as you want, now's the time I'm gonna switch to a smaller pen again. And I'm just gonna come in here and start doing all sorts of different vein shapes. <laughs> So you can just keep going on and on and adding leaves behind leaves or over on top of leaves and add any kind of veins that you like. Some might look like roses, some might look like beech leaves, some might look like oak leaves or maple leaves. Whatever you want to create, just make it your own. And if you wanted to come in and color in the background like we did with the flowers, then that would be awesome too. You could do this in different shades of green and have a blue background, but just play around with these doodling leaves. <laughs> 